Long-awaited debut of the scintillating amateur Danny R. Yelusinov, an absolute hero already. Time at 27 to let him go. Noah Kidd, the first opponent who's an unbeaten novice from Missouri. And he will come to the pros. But Yelusinov, we believe, and what we've seen is pretty special. Won everything you can possibly lose. Oh, Laurie landed a lovely straight left, walked. Eddie Hearn says he's like David Beckham back in Kazakhstan, stopping to take this in. But he's walked straight into a lovely shot from Yelusinov. Classy. And look what they're doing back home. Yeah, both of them are having fine careers. Nice left hand. Beautiful right as well from Yelusinov. Yeah, but he's good left hand as well from Kid, and that'll just wake you loosen of up. Gold medalist on one of those occasions, world champion too. And a pedigree can carry you a long way, but it is a different sport, isn't it? Yeah, without a doubt. I mean, the pedigree is great. there and say though, it's it's not often that a long reigning world champion won't have had a good amateur career. Yeah, no, like, like you say, it's generally, it is the rule. If you're, you're a good world champion, you probably were a good amateur, but, it, you know, a loose enough, exceptional amateur. Landing cleanly here, but like you say, obviously has all the skill in the world, good technical ability, but I wonder, does he lack a little bit of power? A nice one, too, there. Really snapping the head back of uh, Noah Kidd. But like I say, all the skill in the world, massive amateur pedigree. They, they, they feel he's well able to cope with someone like Kid, but again, he works him onto a backhand there. Kazakhstan, but we were talking to the group, the uh, team around him, and he's going to base himself down in South Florida in Miami. So much good sparring there. You know, you get everybody, the Cubans, good left hand from Yelusinov. Yeah, good accuracy here from Luzon. Oh, oh a wonderful shot. Didn't see that coming at all. Noah Kidd. And there's the class of Daniel Yelusinov. And he's badly hurt here. Not sure he's going to get through this. There's 55 seconds left in the round. And he's really shaky. And here comes Daniel Yelusinov. Well, you wondered if he had any power, Matt. Maybe this is the answer. Yeah, well, I think it was the accuracy and the speed. He walked them on to it. He didn't... For a moment, I wasn't sure he was going to make that. He looked very unsteady. Yeah, and he's, again, he's turned his back, and I think he wants out here. The corner's about to throw the towel in. I think he's been hurt to the body as well, Adam. And you loosen off again. Yeah. A crunching body shot all over. Inside three rounds. Danny R. You loosen off. Shot a lot of pride there. Got hit flush with some shots, but took it well. But then when he walked him onto that left hand that he didn't see coming, that caused the first knockdown. That's when we see the class of Yelusinov.